Uh, next up is the team that's picked fourth this year, and that's the Javelinas from A&M Kingsville. I'm going to bring up head coach Bo Atterbury, and Bo's in his sixth year with the Javelinas and has six first-team all-conference players back. Thanks, Dan. I appreciate it. You and your staff do a great job, as everyone said. And uh, Texas A&M Kingsville is a great place, and what makes it so great is, is the people, and I've got some of those individuals here. Uh, I'd like to introduce them. If you guys could stand up so everybody can see you. You came all this way, you might as well get some love, right? Starting with Shane Melling, Sports Information Director. There you go. Fred Noosh, needs no introduction, does a little bit of everything for us. Tanya Allen, Head Volleyball Coach. Stephanie Johns, volleyball player. Coach Ryan Dahl, cross country, track and field. And then I've got a couple players with me today. Uh, Jeremy Aguilar, as you saw, was uh, the linebacker of the year last year. Uh, very excited to have him. And uh, we'll graduate in December. You guys, again, know of him. Uh, don't believe the hype. He knows that. He's come out, been working, he'll do well. And then Jonathan Woodson. Uh, running back, kick returner, led the nation in uh, all-purpose yardage last year, won the indoor 200 meter. Uh, he can go for sure. Uh, they've been working really hard, got a lot of guys on campus. Uh, we've also got a new addition who's not here today. Uh, Brian DeAngelis will be our new athletic director. Look forward to him getting on campus. It's an exciting time. We're getting new field turf, new track. Um, things are going well. I'm excited to be here. Uh, I've got a great staff that works for me. Um, with me, I'll say. Uh, and then we'll have 20-plus uh, seniors coming back next year. I say 20-plus because there's still some classes taking place and some of those type of things. But uh, that's, that's what excites me most is um, there's uh, going to be a lot of those guys that are playing their last year for us and they've done a really good job and been with us and wear our colors proud. Offensively, uh, 9 of the 11 coming back. Um, we should be able to score some points. Um, defensively, you know, we were real close in a lot of games last year um, on both sides of the ball and even in the kicking game. I think if we just take care of our business a little bit better and um, it'll push us through so we can get some more of those wins like we did the year before. Um, really excited about a lot of these guys. Again, we've got two with us, but hopefully all of them make a name for themselves. Um, by the time it's all said and done, I don't – fourth, the um, – I don't know that they're going to take four teams to the playoffs from the Lone Star Conference, so uh, we're going to have to mix that up. Thank you. <laughs> 